Hashem said, if you're going to come back to me, I'm going to come back to you. Means that like that we need to come back from somewhere, he also needs to come back from somewhere. Means that if we're going to come back to him, he will come back to us. What does it mean to come back to him? And the main thing is, what does it mean that he will come back to us? We know that we need to come back to him because we messed up. We feel that we messed up. We remember that we failed. We remember that we could do something good and we chose to go to the other direction. We remember that we had a great opportunity to succeed and we ruined it with our own hands. We know that we sinned. We remembered. We know the rules. We know the halachot, the Jewish rules, the commandments. We know them. And we know that we failed in them. And therefore, we need to come back to Him and to apologize and to fix. But why does He need to come back? And what does it mean that he needs to come back? Can it be that Hashem did something wrong? Can it be that the creator of the universe, he messed up, that he also needs to come back? And if he needs to come back, so why his tshuva depends on ours? When Hashem is telling us, Shuvu Elai Shuvu Elechem, is that when we're going to complete our tshuva, and we're really going to come back to Hashem, Hashem will start feeling that he did something wrong to us that he will get to that level of awakeness because of our tearing eyes, because of our new commitment to him, because of our love to the, to, the, to the Almighty, that his Torah will be the most important thing for us in the world, that we will want to commit ourselves to him with a happy heart and a wishing soul, and even in days of struggles and days of poverty and darkness, no matter what, we want to do more and more. When we're going to impress him, going to touch his heart so deep, in such a great way, he will start feeling bad for causing us that thing to apologize, bringing us to that place of deep regret. And he will feel regret, and he will want to come back to us because that he himself is the real reason for the creation of all worlds. Because he's the one that started that will circling. He's the one who brought us down to earth. He's the one that minimized the moon. He's the one that exiled his children. He was the one that sent Adam and Eve with probably or maybe without enough guiding down to earth to survive over there and to deal with snake and more snakes that are all around the world today multiplying. In reality the Creator should also come back to us. Now the thing is to understand in the path that you and him are one.